Viewers, Rectangular back, this time with another Marvel Legends news update. Well, if you have been on the internet the past few days, you saw that Hasbro finally put out the official images for the Guardians of the Galaxy Wave. I had already announced the case assortment, so if you've been watching my channel, you already knew what was coming. Uh, I just didn't have the pictures yet. And for some reason, Hasbro is being real stingy about the way that they distribute these official images. So I had to use some uh, friends of mine to gather the photos um, since Hasbro didn't want to put them up on, on their official portal. So thank you to the DMC for these. Um, again, not a, not a big surprise here with any of these uh, figures. The... Uh, you know, obvious thing was that since Star Lord is going to be two per case, he is not going to come with a build a figure piece. So that's good for those that just want to collect the movie figures and don't care about uh, building the the build a figure. So um, yeah, the only there's only probably two or three figures out of this wave that I'm um, trying to pick up, and uh, I'll probably end up buying Titus once he's. Uh, affordable on eBay. The next bit of news that came out this week was the Build-A-Figure for an upcoming Spider-Man wave. This I was I, what I assume is the movie uh, Spider-Man wave and the Build-A-Figure apparently is going to be Vulture from the movie and um, you know for people who are into movie figures uh, this looks pretty pretty interesting. Uh, apparently the wings are supposed to have like 12 points of articulation. So, um, yeah, not not something that I would want. You know, I'm not a big Spider-Man fan anyway, but, uh, you know, a lot of people think it's a, it's a cool concept uh, design for the movie. So, um, yeah, it's a... Uh, um, for me, it's always sad to see a movie build a figure instead of a comic book um, based character. But um, you know, I think I think overall people will be happy with it. And the latest information is that we apparently are going to be getting a Black Panther. I'm assuming this is going to be for a Black Panther wave. The online seller that listed it has it listed under Captain America Civil War which we know we're not getting a, a Captain America Civil War movie in 2017 um, some people were speculating that it's a Walgreens exclusive but I highly doubt that that is the case because uh, this online seller would not be uh, listing it if it was a Walgreens exclusive it, you know Walgreens is the only uh, site that would be carrying this figure if that was the case. So um, I'm still trying to find a UPC for this item and then that will hopefully lead me on to what else we're going to be getting but my guess is that we're going to get a Black Panther based wave. Um, they might brand it under Captain America Civil War because that's just the easiest way for Hasbro to um, to market it. Um, but my guess is that it's going to be a, a Black Panther wave and um, mostly reused parts. It looks like it's got the hands from the uh, most recent Civil War uh, Black Panther, but it also comes with a set of interchangeable hands. Uh, looks like a fist on the left side and um, like a gripping hand on the right. Um, it might have a trigger finger. It's kind of hard to tell from this angle. Also coming with a necklace and a spear. I'm pretty sure that's the same spear from Craven. I haven't had time to uh, do a close comparison, but um, that would be my guess. And I'm not sure if that's the same. I think it's a new necklace. I don't think it's the same necklace from, from White Tiger. I'm pretty sure it's not. But I uh, think that that is going to be the cape from uh, the new Adam Warlock that's going to be coming in the second um, Guardians wave. So, you know, a lot of reuse here, but um, but I think overall fans are going to be fr pretty happy. Uh, I'm happy to see it. Um, you know, I was lucky enough to pick up the, um, I think that was the Hit Monkey Wave uh, Black Panther, so I have a couple of those, but, um, but yeah, it 
looks like it's going to be nice. And what's most exciting is the prospect of getting an entire Black Panther wave of figures. So I'm pretty stoked about that. And um, yeah, when I find out more information, I'll let you guys know. Hopefully you guys like the video. You share with your friends. Subscribe if you haven't already. And I always love hearing back from you guys. So please leave a comment below. Thanks so much for watching. And I'll talk to you guys later. Crispy.